Hey everybody, Sister Fantastic here, and today's video is a collab with my friends uh, Joy Keeps You On Your Toes and Becky's Empty Nest. And so these girls and I have been planning this collab for a few days now, and uh, so anyway, we enjoyed the last collab that we did together, and I'll link that up here in the cards for you. And today we decided, since we all have this beautiful Natasha Denona uh, peak palette that we would use it and today I'll be using these beautiful shades so I picked out this top to wear and actually this is the first time I've ever used this palette so this is going to be like a first impressions for me but from all the reviews I'm just going to brush my brows real quick y'all I put some gel on them and I just want to brush it through anyway but um I have a single shadow from Natasha Denona that came in, I think, an Ipsy bag a while back. But anyway, um, these beautiful warm tones are right up my alley. This is this is my jam right here. So I just feel like I'm just totally in my element, and I've already primed my lids. So I'm just I'm using my Jaclyn Hill eye brushes today. I'll just show you all of them. I have face brushes too, but I've already done my face pretty much, except for my highlighter, but I'll use that at the end. So anyhow, I'm just going to go in with this uh, base color right here, and I'm just going to set down my eyeshadow primer, which I used the concealer from Koki Cosmetics today. And it's a favorite of mine. I'm right down to the end of it. I had to pull out the little... Um, what do you call it? The plug. I pulled the plug. Okay, and I'm just going to go right up underneath here just a little bit as well. And I have to warn y'all, my eye is watering today. This left eye here. The change in the weather. We had a we have a cold front that's moving in right now and it is taking over and I woke up this morning to like 33 degree weather oh my gosh I'm freezing I got my heater cranked up we have a gas heat in our house which is a really warm heat but the drawback on that is it dries out your skin so anyway I've done a mask and put on some moisturizer and uh, used a uh, SPF 20 moisturizer. Let me just share this with y'all. I haven't used this in a long time and I I need to use this up anyway. But it, this is the Jergens Natural Glow Face Daily Moisturizer with SPF 20, which is perfect for those days when you're inside the house. You're not really going out, but you are going to be in front of your computer screen. So, you know, it's really good. Okay. Let me go in with a fluffy brush here. I'm trying to decide which. Let me use this one. This is the JH45. I like this brush. And I'm going to go in with this light orange color right here. And I'm not sure about the pigment on this. So I'm going to see how this happens here. So it's easier for me to build up. I'm one of those people that likes to build up my looks for the most part, especially on something that I'm trying out that's new. That's a pretty color, y'all. That's really pretty. I can't wait to see what the other girls are doing. Joy and Becky, um, evidently enjoyed the last collab that we did together so they both wanted to keep going and I'm happy about that so y'all might see some stuff from us on a regular basis so I'm not sure we'll always use the same palette we may just choose a theme and everybody you know pull something out of their collection or I don't know what we'll come up with but we're gonna take turns deciding and it's gonna be fun so I'm ready to go with the flow. I'm just ready to be with some people. I'm just happy to collab. I love these girls. They're really both really super sweet, very generous in their personality. 
very giving people and uh joy joy is she reminds me of like the kind of person that could just be your little sister you know what i mean it's just uh you just want to hug on her and love on her and buy her stuff and you know and just give her all kinds of goodies and spoil her rotten and then becky becky's the kind of person that's uh she's real easy going really laid back she's a good listener i just feel like she's the kind of person you could open up your heart to that you could just pour out you know whatever it is that you're going through that she would never judge you or um you know look down on you because you're going through something or try to find fault in you or compete against you you know anything like that she's just really super sweet and I just love her to pieces. I love both of these girls to pieces. And I'm super happy. I'm super happy to be a part of all of this. I've been wanting to do collabs with friends for a long time. A long time. And nothing ever really worked out. And so Mask Mondays um, is awesome. I mean, I am I am so in my element there because skincare is my jam. Okay, now I'm gonna go in, I'm gonna brighten this up a little bit. I'm gonna get really brave. And I'm going to go in with that darker orange. And oh my gosh, I'm just going to use the teeny tiniest little bit of pigment. Ah. Uh, woo! I knew it was going to be like this. Y'all, these shadows are pigmented. Look at that orange. Oh my gosh. Holy moly. We got... A bright orange here. I'm gonna go swing this around. Oh wow, I'm gonna blow it out. We're going up and out with this color. Wow, look at that color. I'm super impressed with this, y'all. Boom. Boom shakalaka. Okay, I'm just going to pat that in right there before I start to blend that out. It's a sunny day here in Savannah, Tennessee, but it is cold. And I am thankful for a good warm house. Now, y'all notice since I'm left-handed and whenever I go to the right side of my face or my eyes, sometimes I hold the brush like this because it's just more comfortable. And some people are like, how in the world can you do that? But I find that if I'm comfortable holding the brush, then I get a better look. Okay, here I go, y'all. I'm going to swing this around. And I'm going to blow it out. Y'all hear my dog barking? My husband made me home from work. Wow. I am super impressed. That's Sweet Pea. She's my barker. I mean, he'll bark too, but she, he gets, she gets him going sometimes. But for the most part, he doesn't bark unless there's somebody on the front porch or something. Okay. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. I'm scared. I'm scared to go any farther, y'all. That brown is like, is scary. Okay, but I'm going to try it. So I'm going to go in with a smaller brush. And I'm going to pick up just the smallest amount and just work right here in this outer corner. And just swing that right around. So 
so just this little outer V section just this little bit right here oh yeah that adds some nice depth okay I'm just gonna give a little lift to the eye just by dragging this up like an eyeliner to help my hooded eyes okay okay Natasha did own it I see you Y'all, if you've ever had chihuahuas, you know what they're like. They bark and bark and bark. But once you get settled with them someplace, like in for the night or whatever, I mean, they will lay all over you. They are the best little dogs to sleep with. And they're so loyal. They love to be in your lap all the time. I mean, 24-7 if you let them. They would rather be with you than eat. And that is the truth. Okay. Wow. Now, the only color that we haven't used is this pretty shimmer. Let me swatch it for you so you can see what we're working with here. Boom. Look at that. Well, that is going to go everywhere. <laughs> uh, okay, I'm going to go in with this little bitty brush, the JH52. I love this little brush. Well, now I've dropped it. Dad gum it. I don't guess I'm going with that brush after all. Uh, I guess I'll use the JH48, which is like a flat packing brush. And I'm going to put this on the lid. And I may need a smaller mirror so I can see what I'm doing. There's my husband, y'all. Let me cut this off and say hello to him, and then I'll be back. Okay, y'all, I'm back. I wanted to say hi to him and greet him and let the dogs bark and, you know, do all the things that they do, jump all over him. Okay, what I'm doing now is I'm just going in with that that shiny color in the palette that I swatched and I'm just putting that on my lid and I'm not really happy with the results so I'm going to spray my brush so I'm using the Tarte Stay Spray Let's try that again. So, it's a gold color. I thought it was like a silver at first. But then when I swatched it, I saw the gold in it. I was like, that doesn't make any sense, you know, silver with all these warm colors. And if that's the way it was going to be, I was going to be kind of disappointed because, you know... I, I really like golds with warm colors like this. Okay, I'm going just a little bit above my natural lid there. And I'm still not happy. I'm going to use my finger. Let me just use my finger. Let's we'll see what kind of results we can get with this. Oh, yeah, there we go. Boom. Boom, ladies and gentlemen, we have gold shimmer. Mm-hmm. Can y'all see that? So pretty. That's like my favorite thing at Christmas time is gold. I used to paint all the time. I did ceramics and I would paint and do crafts and all that. 
and uh, I haven't done much of that in the last few years. But anyway, the point is that at Christmas time I would always reach for those golds, especially to decorate, you know, whatever ornaments I was making. And I, what am I doing? Huh. I'm supposed to be using my finger. Oh yeah, this works. This shade works a lot better with your finger, y'all. Okay. I am so tempted to put this underneath my brow. I think I'm going to do it. But I am going to use this brush. It's going to go right underneath the brow. Oh, yeah. Ooh, this gold is so pretty. Okay, so there you go. That is the eye look. And I used all five colors, which I'm really proud of myself. But that made for a beautiful eye look. I mean, just beautiful. That's a really nice little palette. I like five shadow palettes like that because that's just the perfect amount of shadows. Okay, I'm going to... I'm going to go off camera here and I'm going to finish my eyes. I'm going to put on some mascara and I'm going to put on some highlight and I'm, I'll come back and I'm going to do a lip look with you guys to finish this off. Okay, y'all, I'm back. I put on mascara. I used a little bit of eyeliner. I used the Araceli Ara, Ara and this is in the shade uh, Cinnamon and I put some on my waterline and my tight line and up above the lashes right there on the outside and then I went in with the Maybelline Lash Sensational uh, Full Fan Effect Mascara. I love this mascara, y'all. This is a good volumizing mascara from the drugstore. And it's not waterproof, but as long as you're not bawling your eyes out, you're going to be okay. And then for my highlighter today, I'm using this one from Wonder Beauty. It's called uh, After Hours. And it's a really pretty, like a peachy pink. Let me just swatch it for you. I love this highlighter. That's it right there. So you could use this um, also as an inner quarter highlight on this look. But it's really finely milled. It doesn't show texture. Oh, I'm dropping stuff, y'all. It doesn't show texture, and it's just a beautiful highlighter. So I am glowing. I am glowing, baby. Now, I am ready to go in with this lip look. So today, um, I decided that I was going to use the ginger shade of my Kylie Lip Kit. And so, I've got this beautiful, beautiful lip kit here. And I love this shade. And I better use a mirror. <laughs> I love these lip kits, y'all. If you, I'm not going to fill in my lips, but I am going to uh, line them. But if you wanted your lipstick to last a really super long time, like all day long, you know, you could take the lip liner and fill in your lips and then you're good to go. Put the, you know, the liquid lipstick on top of it and you're good to go for the whole day. I mean, I'm talking about eating lunch and everything.
So there you go. It's like a rich brown, orangey brown, which is perfect for this eyeshadow. So anyway, what do y'all think? I mean, we're talking about, we're kicking it for fall here. That's awesome. I love it. I love this look. This is my jam right here, you know, especially for fall. All right. Well, that is it for me today. I can't wait to see what you girls do. Thank you, Becky. Thank you, Joy. I love y'all with all my heart. It's awesome to collab with you guys. Um, you gals, <laughs> I should say. Anyway, we're going to have to... We're going to have to come up with a name for our little group here. <laughs> the, the, the Three Amigos or the Three Musketeers or I don't know. Anyway, we'll, we'll see what we can come up with. I'm just playing right now. But listen, I love this palette, y'all. Natasha Denona. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. So anyway, if you have not subscribed to BoxyCharm, you are missing out. Because they are giving out some really great stuff these days. <coughs> So, I'm super happy with this palette. I just think it turned out beautiful. And I will definitely be making this look again. And it's so sleek and so slender. I can just pop it in my purse whenever I travel. And I just feel bougie. It's some bougie eyeshadow. Anyway. Alright, I'm going to quit rambling. I love y'all. I'm going to leave their links down below. Y'all be sure to check out their channels. And, you know, subscribe and like and see their videos as well. And I will uh, chat back with you in the comments as usual. So that's it for me today. God bless you today is my prayer. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.